Next up from Xinhua News Agency, government alcohol bans depressed consumption. National restrictions on food and alcohol consumption by officials have substantially reduced growth in the catering sector, according to Chinese government statistics. The regulations prohibiting the purchase of certain luxurious liquors and limiting total spending allegedly hit high-end restaurants and producers particularly hard. While the entire industry showed income growth of 8.4 percent, high-end businesses saw their incomes fall 3.3 percent. In reaction to growing outrage over lavish official banquets, various levels of Chinese government implemented regulations on spending and consumption. China's military banned the serving of alcohol at banquets, while various provinces put together a list of luxurious foods and drink like baijiu to be taken off the menu. The incoming administration of Xi Jinping has taken pains to emphasize a more modest status quo, pushing cadres to reduce waste. Data shows that at the start of this year, Beijing and Shanghai saw roughly 35 and 20 percent declines in business for high-end restaurants. Researchers from the country's National Development and Reform Commission have gone so far as to say that the reduction in official spending has brought down growth rates in total consumer spending. While the first two months of 2013 saw a 12.3 percent increase in total social consumption, that marked a two percentage point slowdown in growth from last year. Don't go away because up next in Money Matters, we'll see how a policy designed to help middle-class Chinese purchase a home has been derailed by the banks. Stick with us.